Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Now today's video is going to be a mixture of different types of things. So the first thing are retainers. I don't have mine in right now but you know teenagers normally get braces and I've gone through that so I'm going to share my experience with you guys and give you guys a little update with the rats and all this stuff. So let's get started. So basically this is my smile. Pretty pretty pretty. And you want to make sure that you always clean out your retainers and make sure that it's very nice. And this is the case that it comes in and I accidentally lost my sticker but it gives your identity and your information so if it's lost it can be found. This is what the actual retainer looks like and mine have been used before so you might be seeing it dirty but beforehand they are pretty clean and keep them very clean by toothbrush or other usage. So when you're eating, this is one of the biggest questions that many people ask. What can you eat? And the answer is everything. You are now able to eat everything and anything without your retainers on. So once you have cleaned out your retainers for the day, you have to put them back in for night or really whatever your dentist or orthodontist tells you to do and you need to follow the directions. If they say no caramel, then I'm sorry. You, honey, you can't have caramel. Do not eat with these in. They become disgustingly gross. And make sure you keep them away for dogs, from dogs, because they love the saliva. Yes, disgusting, but number one fact in the world of dogs is they love eating saliva. They will chew these cases apart and get to this so keep it at a high spot so that they cannot reach or consume any of the material inside. The second commonly asked question for DMing and all this stuff is do braces hurt? And the answer is yes, of course. They are transforming your teeth into straight perfect little nuggets, I guess. And so basically they put the wire on, they put the brackets on, and they put the bands to keep the wire and the brackets on. And what they do is transform your mouth. You could start with a retainer. You could start with an expander that you have to crank it with a key every night. You could just start right off with braces or you have to go twice. Getting braces twice will cost more but potentially leave your teeth like this. Now I've only had them once and I had them for about a year and a half. So this is what they can transform into. As you can see, my smile is beautiful because of my straight teeth. The one reason why people get braces is because their teeth aren't as straight as others. They may have an overbite, which I do. They might have crooked teeth. They just want to be fixed. So um, you want to try to get them when you've lost all of your teeth. That's pretty important because if you didn't, you'd be just kind of like losing teeth but they'd still be in your mouth because of the fact that the braces are attached to your tooth but they're attached to the other teeth so basically they'd be stuck in your mouth until they took them off and then it'd just be like blood and everything so just lose your teeth before you get braces so that was my little speech on braces and retainers and expanders and everything like that now I'm gonna get on to the rats okay so as you guys see I got them a little salad It's it's a school salad, and excuse my Graciana's burpee, but there's a tomato and cucumber and lettuce in it, and they're fairly large compared to my finger. So yeah, I'm gonna give that to them, and you guys can see a little footage of that. Sorry if it is messy. It's kind of, you know, time to clean it, but as you can see, my girls are the messiest girls ever. Also, a new update! They have a little travel carrier. A lot of you recommended me to get one. And hey, look what's here. So this is just a glass aquarium. And it's a bit foggy because I just cleaned it. Uh, inside is a hay litter box, food, water, chew bowl, and then house with the washcloth on top and that's all it is and it's huge compared to my hand there's comparison to my hand it's really big so yeah come here girls I'm gonna give you your lettuce they do love their lettuce 
I'm gonna throw that away. Come here, girls. They're upstairs sleeping because it is daytime. And they're sleeping. <laughs> but mainly you just crush it up like yeah. And I just kind of leave the tomato unless I want to pop it, which might splatter everywhere. Oh! It splattered everywhere. Okay. Oh, here comes some hungry girl. Oh, kisses. Get that tomato off. Oh, a little girl. Oh, it's a special little girl. <laughs> oh, sweetheart. Here. Oh, there she goes. So, guys, I hope that you enjoyed this video. And sorry for the bad lighting. Don't forget to rate, subscribe, and comment. And I'll see you guys with my next video. Bye. Rate, subscribe, like, comment your lucky number. The person of the week this week is Macy Tour. If you comment your lucky number down below, you can get a free shout out. If you enjoyed it, check out my other video, Halloween theme cage tour.